Welcome everybody to this abbreviated version of Go Local Live on Friday, July uh, 5th. <laughs> Almost said it was the 6th. Uh, I hope everybody had a great 4th of July and enjoyed the tremendous weather Rhode Island's enjoying. Uh, it's this time every week that our, uh, our favorite editorialist with his video editorials, Ray Rickman, head of Stages and Freedom, uh, one of the uh, most important civil rights leader in Rhode Island, gives his views uh, on what's going on both in Rhode Island in America. So, Josh, I actually wonder, can you pass the test? You're one of the brightest people I know. Yes, is you can. New York Times yesterday, 4th of July, citizenship test, and they listed the 10 toughest questions. There are 100 questions, but when you go to try to become a citizen of the United States, you only get 10. And it's by random, and it's sorted, and you never know what you're going to get. So you have to study all 100. But in a study, they decided these were the 10 tough ones. Now, if you have a pen, a pencil, or your computer, I want you to write these questions down really quick, because when you go to take the test, if you are becoming a citizen of the United States of America, you don't get three minutes to answer each question. I took it yesterday and I got nine right, and I would have got ten, but I write the, wrote the right answer down and then I changed it to the wrong answer. Eh, I'm, eh nine and a half. Nope, nine. You ready? You ready? How many amendments does the Constitution have? Now that's the one I got wrong. Which of these is something Franklin I'm sorry, Benjamin Franklin is known for. The first person to sign the Constitution, he discovered electricity, he was the nation's second president. Who was president during World War I? Wilson, Harding, Coolidge, or Franklin Delano Roosevelt? Which statement correctly describes the rule of law? The law is what the president says it is. The people who enforce the laws do not have to follow them. No one is above the law. Judges can rewrite laws they disagree with. Okay, next one. Under the Constitution, which of these powers does not belong to the federal government? Ratify amendments to the Constitution, print money, declare war, make treaties with foreign powers. Number six, elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Four, six, eight, or twelve. Number seven, who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Roberts, Ginsburg, Barr, or Kavanaugh? The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 100, 435, 535, 538. The Federalist Papers support the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Which one of these men was not an author of the Federalist Papers? Madison, Hamilton, John Jay, John Adams. Which one? When was the Constitution written? This is my favorite one. And this is the most difficult one, the one that uh, something like 40% of the people wanting to be citizens of the United States failed. When was the Constitution written? 1492, 1776, 1787, 1865. Now, if you didn't have the pen, pencil, computer ready, you can, you know, go to Go Local and watch this again later and take the test. Let me know how you did. <laughs>